What's up, YouTube, and what you know, my name is Domino with the Zero, and welcome back to Pokemon Crystal, the completely randomized Nuzlocke, episode 46. Welcome to potentially, I think, the last week, I don't know why we're looking at this, the last week of our Pokemon Crystal um, Let's Play. So we're in the last few episodes, I'm going to go ahead and run this way uh, while I'm talking. In the last episode, which was last week... I believe we made our way from Pewter City down here to Pallet Town. I don't 100% remember. But I do remember. Oh, yes I do. <clears throat> I remember that there were like... There was a Fampy, there was a Weedle, and we couldn't catch them. We wound up running out of balls, so I wound up going back. I did go back all the way to our home and filled up on money. You can barely tell. But um, you can see here, I have 30 Hyper Potions and 50 Ultra Balls. Um, so, uh, hold on, let me switch this. <clears throat> so we're all ready to go, and that should get us through the end of the game, I do imagine. Uh, now, you'll also, if you didn't see the last episode, we caught something new. I don't want to spoil it if you haven't seen it, but we caught something new that's really hype that I did not add to the team, um, just because grinding it up would take a really long time. And uh, our team is pretty good right now, so uh, we're gonna save. We're gonna save that in case something happens. But if something happens to any of our team, we already know who we're gonna put on. So if you want to check out the last episode from last week, you can click right above my face, and it will take you to that episode. <clears throat> in today's episode, we're gonna go from Pallet Town down to Cinnabar Island and go from there. Again, this is this is probably the last few episodes. Of crystal. In fact, I might finish it in this uh, grind in this uh, recording session. We'll see. But here goes our first encounter. So if you are excited for more Pokemon Crystal, go and hit that like button. Subscribe if you're new. If you wind up enjoying, go ahead and share this video out. It's not too late to get this video or to get this series uh, some new people watching it. <clears throat> so our first encounter is a level 35 Ghastly, which is super. That's exciting because it will evolve the very next level. So again, if something happens, all right. It knows Splash. It also knows Iron Tail. And I almost just killed it. All right. Are you going to be nice to us? First ball magic. <clears throat> oh, yeah. Easy. Piece of cake. Uh, random name generator right there. All right, so we have Ghastly, the gas Pokemon. It wraps its opponent. It wraps its opponent in its gas-like body, slowly weakening its prey by poisoning it through the skin. So we will give a nickname. Go to a feminine nickname. First name only, Police. And we have. <clears throat> I'm gonna say Ace, but it's not just Ace. Like if you look at this, you should be able to see it just fine. Uh, hold on. Wait, how do I do this? I always wondered how to do it. Oh, you can see it. Right, so, oh, no, that's perfect. So, ASE. I don't know what that sign is on the on the A, but if you know, let me know in the comments below, of course. So, uh, we'll check out Ace once we get to a Pokemon Center. Now, who are we? Oh, let's do a quick team recap, right? Because this is the first episode of the week. <coughs> Excuse me. So we have a full team recap today. We have Livia, our ground grass type Steelix, holding the miracles, Miracle Seed to power up Fly, also with Slam, Absorb, and Scratch. With great defense and special attack, or excuse me, defense and special defense, special attack and speed aren't horrible. <clears throat> Next, we have Goliath, our electric type Don Fan, holding the Dragon Fang to power up his Shadow Ball. Also with Rock Slide, Surf, and Horn Drill, the broken Oko move with a, with a higher, what is it? A higher um, accuracy than normal. <clears throat> with great special attack, special defense, and speed, which I just remembered that. So I need, to, I need to teach him something new at some point, maybe. Then we have Uriel, our Ice Normal type Mew, holding the Sharp Beak to power up his Flamethrower. Also with Cut, Fire Blast, and Razor Leaf. Uh, with great attack, defense, and speed, Uriel is our longest tenured member since we lost a friend several episodes ago. We have Lotus Loss, our electric psychic hound Doom, holding the soft sand to power up his Whirlpool. Also a spike cannon, waterfall, and ice beam. 
<clears throat> with great defense, special defense, and speed. <clears throat> then, new to our team, we have Varg, the Psychic Dragon-type Jump Puff, holding the Magnet to power up his, rap his Rapid Spin, also with Ice Beam, Psy Beam, and Earthquake, with insane special attack, especially compared to the rest of his stats, but his attack and speed are not bad either. And lastly, we have Prem, our Fire-type Venusaur, Holding the Magnet to also power up his ra Rapid Spin with Slash, Icy Wind, and Dragon Breath. With pretty good stats all around. That is our team. Now, who's the lowest level? Varg is the lowest level, so Varg will lead us in this episode. <clears throat> we already have encounters here, so I'm not worried about it. We have an Elekid. Alright, so... Man, I can't believe we're in the last week of this series. That means I need to get the next series ready to go. That's what I was just thinking about. I'm in no way ready for the next series to start, but I guess I will <clears throat> I guess I will pull that together sometime. As I said, you'll notice the next three episodes, I think I'll probably be wearing the same stuff, because um, I think I'm going to do them all in this setting. I've seen so many Raikou. There's been so many Raikou in this game. I'm not sure if we're going to have a gym battle today. Depending on how fast I make it, we might. I guess I'm not opposed to it. <clears throat> so electric is weak. Uh, so that means it's a uh, ground type, right? So let's go. Let's just hit it with the earthquake. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, I'm just going to go for Psybeam. Save our PP. Blastoise. Oh, well, hold this ice beam. I don't understand these levels. Why are these level 35s? It's like I'm training against Janine. The terrible gym leader. Alright, I think we've already made it, yep. I'm pretty sure there's going to be a gym battle in this episode. We have made it to Cinnabar Island, uh, where we can heal real fast. <clears throat> now, I'm going to not go up there just yet. Instead, I'm going to catch... Ooh, a Jolteon, okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. So let's go with. Uh, I guess I should have switched. Olivia. Olivia is our weakling. Don't miss. Like I said, that was super effective. I guess absorb is just bad. It's not Olivia's fault. First ball magic. Yeah. This is a much better. This is a much preferred change of pace. Compared to last week where we couldn't catch level 2s and 3s in Pokeballs. Or in Ultra Balls. We have Jolteon, the lightning Pokemon. The negatively charged ions generated in its fur creates a constant sparkling noise. Sparking, not sparkling, sparking. And we have... Whoa. Well, that was correct. We have... Oh. We have Demion. Oh, Demion. Demion. Or Demion. I think it's just Demion. So let's go ahead and head in here. So let's check out our two new people. <clears throat> we have Ghastly, the Rock Poison type. With Icy Wind, Iron Tail, Splash, and Body Slam. Speed's good. Attack's good. Cool. And then we have Demion, the Grass type. With Sandstorm, Dynamic Punch, Psybeam, and Thunder. That attack is ridiculous. Okay, so Demion. We might be able to add Demion to the team, depending on what happens. Uh, if anything happens to our team. Because I think we're definitely going to have a gym battle today. <laughs> which means that we're like... Which means that I seriously might finish the game in this setting. We have a Dodrio as our first encounter. That's pretty good, I suppose. What do I miss? Okay, yeah, you're gonna have to use Scratch. Wait, that's not very fit. Wow! Just getting absolutely messed up. Alright, let's go ahead and switch to Varg. Did he really just predict me? Alright, I'm going for Psybeam. He's a ghost type. Does Earthquake kill it? 
I kind of knew it would. I kind of knew that would kill. Is that, does that make me a bad person? I think that makes me a bad person. At this point, it's like, if we don't have something really good, or something that can evolve, I don't think there's any reason to add stuff to our to our box, because I don't think our team's going to change too much more. Now, that being said, these are the gym battles where everything gets a little more difficult. The levels do get bumped up, so uh, let's go ahead and... Livia, I guess you're coming right back up. Okay, I am apparently already here. Wait. Okay, so I'm still Route 20. So let's go ahead and go this way. Let's make our way up to Fuchsia City and then we'll come back. Because we have some trainers here that we can continue to train on. Uh, I'm a little concerned about the, the gym. Because... Oh, wait. If that said ground wasn't very effective, then that means that it was a flying type and I used a grass type move against it. Oops. <clears throat> wow. Okay, fly is very good. All right. Okay, that did nothing. Oh, that's right. Aerodactyl is super good. I forgot about this. You can't counter my fly with a dig? Are you serious? This game got smarts. Alright, I, I can't imagine there's going to be too many trainers. Okay, we are on Route 19, so our next encounter will be our first encounter in Route 19. You can go ahead and catch that as well. <clears throat> so let's see, uh, I... The only thing I can think to talk about is what's coming up next. Um, there was a game that we played a while back that I had to stop. Um, which if you've watched the channel or if you look at the channel, uh, I'm talking about a Pokemon game. There's only one option. <clears throat> so uh, I attempted to play said game today and was able to make a little bit of progress. Uh, and so it looked like... It looked like maybe it's fixed. Or maybe I can at least manage. So... Next month, that might be coming back. Additionally, I heard from um, the guy that does... Uh, the guy that I've had do a graphics before. He's going to be doing a, a few more graphics for me. Uh, but he said that... Um, one of the things I asked him to make for me will be done um, this week, which is super exciting. So, by the end of August, we should be back to 100%. Um, and there's actually going to wind up being two Pokemon videos every single day. We're going in on the whole PokeTuber thing. If you're a fan of the other stuff, don't worry. It's not going anywhere. That Haunter just decided he did not want life anymore. Alright, are these trainers? Road workers. Oh, that's right, they had road work before, supposedly. Um, if I just run up here, I'm gonna heal here in Fuchsia City, and I'm just gonna run straight back and challenge what's his face. Wait! I definitely had encounters. I just skipped my Route 19 encounter. What would it have been? Was it a Quagsire? Uh, it might have been a Poliwag. That's kind of unfortunate. I totally didn't even think about it. Alright! Wow, I didn't really expect to do this today, but uh, let's go ahead and do it. Stand next to my boy, face away from him. Two gym battles left, one today and one in the next episode. And then we take on the Elite Four. And then we go to Mount. Silver!
Right? Isn't it round? Isn't it silver? I can't see it, can I? I'm pretty sure it's called Mount Silver. I finally remember what it's called. Um, so actually, yeah. And then Friday we'll do a special episode and evolve everything um, that we haven't got that died. So we'll see what we could have potentially had. Um, wow, this will be the last week of Crystal. <clears throat> wow, my gym and Cinnabar burned down. My fire-breathing Pokemon and I are homeless because of the volcano. Ah. But I'm back in business as a gym leader here in this cave. If you can beat me, I'll give you a badge. Ha! You better have a burn heal. All right, Blaine. Let's go. Let's go. Wait, let me get this music. Wait, hold on. It stopped working. I gotta get some new headphones. Good thing I just got a new job. Anyway, um, Dancer Jasmine wants to battle. Starts off with a Murkrow. The levels have jumped. Okay, he's starting at level 50. These last two gym leaders don't really play around. All right, let's go and fly. Get up out of there. He read me. He just read me. Do some damage. Do some damage, Livia. Do some damage. All right, not bad. I don't think Solar Beam's too strong. I shouldn't talk. Okay, that's super effective. Uh, let me go for Slam. The reason I did that is because he would have to take in uh, Sunlight. All right, we're getting out of here. Actually, no, let's just go for Fly. Yeah, because it's a Grass-type move and that's special, so this will kill it. Okay, good. That was a... I was almost nervous because I thought I miscalculated. And Livia would have been gone. Sounds out a Natu. A level 50 Natu. Alright, let's go into... How about back to Varg? I don't know why, but for some reason I'm not very worried about this Natu. That's probably a mistake. Aurora Beam? Do we know what type Aurora Beam is? Is that a Steel type attack? Alright, go for your rapid spin. Gone! One shot! Come on, Blaine, you're better than this. What's your last mine? A Charmeleon! A level 55 Charmeleon. You should train that up a little more. Alright. Um, let's go into Prem, the actual fire type. That didn't make any sense, but... Shadow Ball, that's a Ghost-type attack. Wait. That did a lot. Alright, go for a Rapid Spin. I don't know what type Charmeleon is. That's not very effective, I couldn't tell. You did not just crit me. Wow! Well! So Prem is a fire type, which means... We didn't really lose too much, I guess. But I'm gonna go back out to Varg. And I'm gonna use Rapid Spin. Actually, I... Ah, uh, well this might kill, because I think Varg's special attack is higher than Prem's, yeah. That's so disappointing. Dancer Jasmine was defeated. Awesome. I've burned out. <clears throat> You've earned Volcano Badge. <clears throat> I did lose this time, but I'm going to win the next time. When I rebuild my Cinnabar Gym, we'll have to have a rematch. All right, and this guy just like popped in. Yo, this reminds me of Goku. If you're watching Dragon Ball Super, if you're not watching Dragon Ball Super, this isn't spoilers, so don't be worried. But um, there's a scene in the current episodes, a couple episodes ago, where there's something's happening and Goku is, he's not involved at all. And then, like, he just randomly pops out of nowhere and he just goes, yo. <laughs> it's so funny. Huh? It's over already? Sorry, sorry, Cinnabar Jim was gone, so I didn't know where to find you. But hey, you're playing strong without any advice. I knew you'd win. My guy. 
Like I said, he knew. He knew. Well, let's go ahead and fly back to Cinnabar. Now, don't heal just yet. <sighs> so let's go change box. Box 13. Withdraw. Oh, man, this means I have to do a grinding montage before the next episode, which really stinks. Anyway, that's okay. I will live. Uh, deposit. Prem, you did good. You did good, Prem. I really liked everything about you. Um, your special defense was probably what just got you killed, though. You should work on that in the afterlife. That's all I have to say. That's all I have to say. And if you didn't see the last episode, then you... You're about to see what we caught, but we caught ourselves a Celebi. So we're going to add Celebi straight onto the team. In fact, I'm going to go ahead and throw the Lucky Egg on right now because I have a grinding montage to do. But we're going to get Tolak up to level 55 to join the rest of the team. And I'm going to try and do all of that tonight so I can continue recording these so I can have like three days of videos recorded. But anyway, that's a whole other thing. That's fourth wall stuff. So in today's episode, oh, in today's episode, we took on Blaine at the Cinnabar gym. And we were successful, but we did lose our fire type, which is kind of ironic. But we lost our fire type, um, Venusaur, Prem. But now we have a Celebi added onto the team, so I'm not super upset. In the next episode, we're going to talk to Blue, and then we'll make our way to Viridian City to take him on to get our final gym badge in our Pokemon Crystal, the completely randomized Nuzlocke. We will see you tomorrow for that. Until then, have a blessed day.